In this video, we're going to learn about jQuery and jQuery UI. Uh, jQuery is a uh, JavaScript library that uh, allows you to write uh, consistent uh, JavaScript that manipulates DOM and uh, accesses uh, network uh, resources in a consistent way with a, an API that uh, has been vetted and has been designed and improved over the years. And it's a, it's a, an industry standard that's uh, used widely uh, in the industry. Uh, this is the uh, website, the uh, jQu go to jQuery.com, and it uh, has an extensive uh, API documentation. You can uh, uh, download it, install it locally, or you can point to CDN. Um, and uh, the API uh, uh, talks about uh, the various uh, functions that uh, the jQuery API allows you to, it provides to manipulate the DOM consistently across uh, browsers. Uh, we're also going to be introducing a, uh, another J, a, a jQuery library uh, that um, extends uh, the, the base core jQuery uh, library by add, it called the jQuery UI, that which adds uh, features that uh, allow you to very easily create uh, very dynamic uh, websites. Uh, so for instance, here are some of the demos that you can take a look at. Some of the interactions and widgets that it, it provides, for instance, allows you to very easily make things draggable, right? And uh, also allows you to uh, very easily create content that can be resized to different, you know, by clicking and dragging, uh, or being able to reorder items, right? That uh, that are a collection of items into different positions, uh, or even order them uh, between uh, in uh, in different columns. Uh, from one list to another list, which is, this is a very powerful uh, library that allows you to create very sophisticated types of um, uh, user interfaces. Also, it has all sorts of widgets that are very useful for web development, such as uh, accordions that have to allow you to break up large content into several subsections, um, autocomplete, date pickers that allow you to uh, give you a consistent uh, behavior of uh, across browsers to uh, select a, a date, um, menu, spinners, tabs, be able to select amongst different content by clicking on, on various tabs. Uh, so, so yeah, so let's, uh, let's uh, take a look at uh, this, uh, these two libraries uh, in the context of an application that we're going to be building throughout uh, several videos. So this is, the, uh, this is the example demo application that we're going to be building, uh, and it consists of uh, using several UI jQuery and jQuery UI libraries uh, to implement something that um, uh, you could perhaps reuse in one of your projects. Um, so we're going to build building uh, something that allows you to click and drag uh, elements from a tools box right, on the left hand side onto a canvas on the right hand side. So for instance here I can I have here three tools right I can click and then drag right, and as I'm dragging I can drop it onto the canvas right uh, and I can drag different different instances of, of the of, ver of these various tools. So here's tool one, two, and three, uh, or different instances of the same tool as well. So I can click and once they are part of the canvas, I can then just drag them around uh, on the canvas. Uh, and uh, the the whole thing is responsive. So I can I can resize the page and everything moves uh, proportional to the page. Right? Even even if uh, if it, if the top doesn't doesn't fit, notice that everything just moves down. Uh, and and everything uh, and the the canvas ma maintains the relative position of the entire content of the page. So I can still drag around and it remembers where everything is supposed to be. Uh, so yeah, so stick around and uh, uh, just follow along. In the next couple of videos, we'll show how we can build this tool using jQuery uh, from scratch.